British billionaire Richard Branson made history on Sunday, becoming the first person to reach the edge of space in his own spaceship. We take a look at what the historic flight means for the future of commercial space travel. It's the history-making moment 17 years in the making. On Sunday, Virgin founder Richard Branson soared into space, becoming the first person to do so in his own spaceship. The VSS Unity, taking off from the New Mexico desert, carrying Branson and five other crewmates. 45 minutes into the flight, the Unity detaching from the mothership Eve, igniting its rocket and propelling the crew to an altitude of 86 kilometers. Then, for a few minutes, passengers enjoying the experience of weightlessness. The nearly 71-year-old Branson telling those watching the live stream, I was once a child with a dream, looking up to the stars. Now, I'm an adult in a spaceship with lots of other wonderful adults looking down to our beautiful, beautiful Earth. To the next generation of dreamers, if we can do this, just imagine what you can do. An hour after takeoff, the Unity safely returning to Earth to jubilant crowds. The historic flight ushers in a new era for commercial space travel. Branson on the ground saying, We're here to make space more accessible to all, all, and we want to turn the next generation of dreamers into the astronauts of uh, today and tomorrow. And the nose is coming Virgin down. Galactic already has more than 600 reservations, with a single nose ticket costing $250,000. The company is planning to fly up its first and space breaking. tourist next year. And in what's being dubbed the billionaire space race, Branson now has bragging rights, beating fellow billionaire Jeff Bezos into space by just nine days. Bezos will blast off from West Texas on the first crewed flight of the new Shepard, the rocket ship made by his company, Blue Origin.